Hey everyone, welcome back to my channel. For today's video, I am going to be opening up a new palette that I just got. This is the Rose Quartz Palette by Huda Beauty. It just came out recently. Also, if you guys are new to my channel, don't forget to subscribe and hit the like button. It helps me a ton. Here is the palette. It's so, so, so pretty, guys. And then inside, here are all of the shades. In today's video, I'm going to be doing an eye look with you guys and also swatching these shades to show you guys all of them and then I'll give you all an overall review of my opinions on this palette if it's worth it or not it does retail for $67 if you like sparkle and glitter flashy colors and kind of like that holographic look you'll probably really like this but it also has some nice neutrals and matte shades in here as well so I'm gonna go ahead and swatch all of these on my arm and I will be right back to show you guys there is also one shade in the center here that is kind of like a gel consistency. I'm not sure how that's going to turn up on my arm, but we will see. Okay guys, so I just went ahead and swatched all these. They are so, so gorgeous. As I went down my arm, I started to angle, but look how glowy and pretty a lot of these are. The mattes are really great too. I would say about three or four of the matte shades were a little bit kind of patchy and had some fallout, but if you build up the color it's totally fine but I'm so impressed I absolutely love it this shade right here is the glossy shade from the center of the palette it's hard to see but it does give you a little bit of a shine and glow so let's go ahead and do a look with this palette I also want to test this palette out without an eyeshadow primer. I always like to try palettes for the first time without any type of primer, just to see how the pigmentation is on its own and how good it actually is without any help. The eyeshadows wipe off pretty easily, but it does leave a lot of sparkles on your skin. But no crazy pigment marks, which I really like. They don't stain your skin like some other eyeshadows. This is one of the Trasluce B102 brush from my recent BoxyCharm. I think I'm going to do a halo eye today. We're going to take this shade to start. It is Gratitude, and I'm just going to work this into my crease. And then I'm gonna go ahead and blend this out. I'm gonna go in next with Aura, which is this darker brown, and I'm gonna work this into the inner and outer corners of the eye. I'm also gonna take some of this color underneath my eye. Normally, I would go in and apply a little bit of concealer in the center, but again, I do want to see the true pigmentation and color of these shades, and I really like this shade. So we're gonna take this one. It is called Moon Magic, and I'm just gonna apply this with my finger in the center. Oh my gosh, you guys, this is so pretty. Wow just put this all over my eye I like it a lot I will say with like moon magic and some of the other like glittery shades they're very creamy very pigmented but you can get a little bit of fallout on your face so just be aware of that I'm gonna go ahead and finish up this look off camera and then I will be back with my thoughts and first impressions review okay guys so I added a little bit of mascara and some lip gloss to finish off the look my eyes are popping I absolutely am obsessed today's video shout out word is rose if you comment rose down below in the comments first you'll get a shout out in my next video I really like this palette. I would say if you guys are on the fence, the colors inside are just as pretty as the packaging. I will say the one in the center, the glossy one, I'm glad that there's only one because I'm excited to try it out for that glossy eye look, but there's not too much pigmentation there. It's a little bit sticky, but all of the other shades are really great. <laughs> I really like them. I think this eyeshadow palette is totally worth it. I'm obsessed. Let me know what you guys think down below. First impressions, I'm like very aesthetic. I'm so happy and 
I can't wait to use this palette some more. I just, I love the pigmentation. I think the formulas are really nice. And especially because I didn't apply any eyeshadow primer, any of that, and they come out pretty nice. The only thing, like I said, is the fallout. If you guys can see below my eyes, there is a pretty good amount of fallout. So if you are trying to get this without the sparkle, I would either wipe off your face after or do your foundation and your face makeup after you do your eyes so you can avoid that extra glitter on your face. And I do love the assortment and variety of colors in here. It's super girly, super fun, extremely pretty. Today's video shout out goes out to Gabby Dawn. Thank you so much for watching my videos. If you guys want a shout out in my videos, make sure to watch the entire video and look out for the shout out word. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you guys haven't, make sure to subscribe, hit that like button and turn your post notification bell on so you guys are updated every time I post a new video. Love you guys. Bye.